Well, good morning. It's uh, very, very cold, very, very early morning, and the team from Octopus was here all day yesterday. They've made a start on getting everything set up for the heat pump. So yesterday was more about demolition. Uh, there's the old tank that they've pulled out, um, sitting next to the, the heat pump itself, which will get installed. So the cabling is all run into place, as you can see as it goes up the wall there. Um, it actually goes up into my attic and then crosses the attic and runs down the other side to the consumer panels. And if you look closely, just up there, you can see where the two pipes are going to exit for the heat pump. Um, and then they will travel back down the wall to here, where everything is ready to build the base this morning. We moved the tank inside last night and obviously the copper piping. We didn't want to leave all that sitting out the front because they're very valuable to people that like to steal uh, copper. So here we are around the other side of the house. And if I tilt up, you can see there the cables run up. They run next to my DC cable and head into the attic there. So that's where they will come out. They will run down the side of the house. They will join my existing cables and run over here to my consumer units. Now, there was one small issue. Um, as you can see by the lovely clear skies, uh, the sun just coming up behind me, and the fact that I'm wearing a very thick coat, it was a very cold night last night. And to have a night without heating, the house was very, very cold. So we had no hot water, no heating. That was planned, that was to be expected. But the guys from Octopus actually did something really nice. In the delivery with all the parts of the heat pump, they included two small two kilowatt heaters. So we were able to keep the house nice and warm last night. Nobody went to bed cold. Um, looking forward to having a bit of hot water today. But other than that, um, we had a pretty comfortable night. So first day, not a huge amount of progress. Um, I'll pop a picture up on the thing here. There's the airing cupboard, sands the water tank. So that's all been pulled out. The main water tank in my loft and the uh, header tank, they're now gone. So I have a lot more space up in the attic. Um, they're all in the skip out the front. So here are the remains of my water tank. Um, obviously the guys had to cut it into pieces to get it down and out of the loft. Um, now normally when Octopus come to do an installation, um, they don't provide a skip. The reason there's a skip here is that we have a whole load of other work going on at the same time. So we're just taking advantage of keeping the place nice and tidy for our neighbors and getting rid of all the rubbish. We did run into one small issue uh, under the blue tarpaulin back there is the water tank. The water tank that was initially ordered was too big to go into my airing cupboard. So that's being picked up this morning and another one is being delivered and hopefully we'll get that installed and we'll at least get some hot water before the end of the day. Now you might be wondering how we're going to have hot water uh, if we don't have the heat pump installed. Well, obviously we have still have an immersion heater. Um, in fact, it's hooked up to my My Energy Eddy. Um, so as soon as the new tank goes in, we'll actually use electricity to heat the water up so we can at least have a shower for the next couple of days until the heat pump is fully installed. And hopefully by the end of the week, fingers crossed that there's no other issues, everything will be installed and we'll be good to go. So that's it for my day one update. Um, this is Bear trying to give me a kiss. But uh, hopefully we'll get a bit of progress today. And like I say, we're looking forward to having some hot water before the end of the day. I hope these short videos have been useful. If you are thinking about getting a heat pump, then please do take a look in the description below. You'll find a, a code. If you use that code with Octopus, you'll get £100 off your heat pump install. And I'll also get £100 off my energy bill. With that, I'll sign off from day one and I'll see you all tomorrow.